Hey, what's up, you guys? WWE fan 0599 here again, and today we're going to review episode 14 of season 3, entitled The Return. So what this episode is basically about is that Thea and Oliver are now going to the island to basically train and get ready for Raz al Ghul. But then what happens is that Malcolm Merlin lets Slade Wilson out of his prison to test them, and now Slade is trying to kill the both of them. By the way, spoilers in this review. So what did I think of this episode? This was a good episode. I enjoyed it, but I will admit it kind of disappointed me. It's kind of, I'm going to say the kind of the worst episode that that Arrow has done this season. And the action's always great, even though we'll get more into the negatives with the action, but the action's still pretty good in this. I really enjoyed the action. The acting for mostly everybody, the acting's great in this. I really enjoyed the, the acting. The scenes between Oliver and Thea were great. I love those, you know, the tension between the both of them. I do like their chemistry. They do you know, work together well as a brother and sister. I really enjoyed them. Also, Slade was great as well. The flashbacks, to me, were actually the best part of this episode. The flashbacks were the most interesting. I really enjoyed the flashbacks. You know, I like the fact that we saw every... We didn't see everybody in the present. We actually saw everybody in the past. We saw Diggle in the past, Laurel, Detective Lance. We saw... Even Felicity we saw in the past, and it was awesome. You know, I really enjoyed seeing when Detective Blanche was in a state where, you know, he was just done. He was an alcoholic because of Sarah dying the first time. You know, him going off on Laurel and Thea, it was good. I really enjoyed that. Also, I like seeing Diggle's brother. I mean, we saw Diggle's brother for the first time ever in this series. If, d correct me if I'm wrong on that, but this is the first time we've ever seen him on the series. You know, we saw in the flashbacks. That was great seeing him. Those are my positives with this episode. I do have, unfortunately, a few negatives with this episode. I felt like the stuff w on the island when we were in present time was boring. I really did think so. I thought it dragged out. It was slow. It really... Nothing really happened. It... It just, only time really stuff happened was when they activated the trap, and when Slade was, like, towards the end when Slade was trying to kill him. That's it. I felt like Slade was wasted in this episode, even though he was great. I felt like he was wasted in this episode. They were making such a big deal out of this. He's back. He's looking to kill, not even in the episode all that much. Not really. I mean, I was disappointed. Like, are you kidding me? You're bringing your second, the second best character of this entire series in for a guest starring role, and he's not even in it all that much, and that's, that's just, that stunk to me a little bit. I mean, he didn't have to be in the entire episode, but at least be in a few more scenes. The action was a little bit shaky at times, like, they did the whole shaky cam action at times, like they would shake the camera, and the series usually never does that, they never do the whole shaky cam thing, they... Let's just see the action, but in this episode, sometimes it was shaky. But then one more thing I forgot to mention is that Oliver finally tells Thea that she killed Sarah, but she, it, of course it wasn't her. She was in, like, a vegetated state, you know? So, yeah, I like that the fact that she, he told her and then that Thea went off on Malcolm about it because, yeah, I did really like seeing that. So, overall, this was a good episode. I enjoyed it. I guess it's time to give my official grade on episode 14. And my official grade on episode 14 is a B. And I cannot wait for next week's episode because Iron Man is got. Oh, uh, wait. Wait, what? It's not Iron Man? Oh, it's the Adam. I'm sorry. The Adam. Finally, he gets into his suit next week, and that's going to be awesome. So, what did you guys think of this episode? Leave it in the comment section below. And I'm WWE Fan 0599, and we'll see you all later. Peace.